Hi guys, it's me Team as well for for Big Tech Land. I hope guys you all do well today. Over topic how to solve this problem when the application was unable to start correctly. So it is very easy and simple. You just play with me. I will tell you step by step. So first of all, you go on the start button. So just right click on the start button. So when you do right click on the start button, here you got the option of run. So click on run. And when you click on run. Here you type temp. So when you type temp, type of files appears in front of you, and here you select all these files and delete all these files. Some files has not been deleted. So you simply keep that. Close it and go back again on the start button. Right click on it, then again select the run. And at this time, here you type percent 10 percent. Click on it. I just maximize it. Here you select all these files. Some file was not deleted. Simply skip this. Close your window. After doing this step, you go on the control panel. So when you go on the control panel, here you got the menu option, and at the downside here you got the option of program. Click on programs. So when you click on programs, here you see the option of programs and features. So click on it. So when you select program and features on the left side, you see this option view installed update turn windows feature on or off. Click on it. So when you do that, type of box appears in front of you, and here you got the menu option. Here you got the person option dot net framework 3.5. So mark this also and then take a time. So you simply when Downloading was complete. Restart your PC. I hope guys this video will be informative for you. And if you think that this video will be helpful for you, so please like this video and be subscribe my YouTube channel for Pick Tech. Thanks for watching guys. See you next video.